difficult to say so. I suppose in the country, with the great changes and development of everything, political system, economical system, social system, maybe it is a little bit too uh, more difficult than, say, in Netherlands. But uh, it is absolutely essential that uh, the political side should be the umbrella for the basis, and the basis is development of infrastructure. Infrastructure is not only railways. This is roads, this is, of course, communications, IT technologies, and energy. So, you know, everything should be coordinated, and it should be done at the governmental level. Because if we are talking just about the city, like London, for example, huge city, huge, a lot of people, but this is, you know, located uh, system. So even there, they have their policy about transport integration and intermobility. If we are talking about a huge country like Russia, it is even more essential. And of course, it is not possible that in St. Petersburg they're doing one thing, in Moscow they're doing third thing, you know, and the railways is divided between the regions. It is not possible. Because, you know, it is absolutely essential that the mobility of the people should be unlimited. People should travel not just because to enjoy, but because they are seeking for the better place, for a better life. And to provide this possibility, you know, the governments, the political system, the nations should consider interoperability. And we are talking about interoperability between the railways of Russia and railways of, say, Europe. We are talking about interoperability of railways of, you know, North and South. And for Russia, being partially in Asia and partially in Europe, it is even more essential. And we are working now closely with Deutsche Bahn, we are working with uh, SNCF, we are talking with uh, Italian railways, we are talking with uh, Spanish railways, with all European railways, in achieving this kind of interoperability. German Railways is a strategic partner for Russian Railways. We signed a document. So in any event, you know, dealing with transport, either in Germany, either in Russia, we are trying to participate. Likewise, for example, in May, Mr. Gruber will go to Sochi to participate in our conference strategic partnership 1520. This is the gauge of railways. And this is again about you know, coordination about interoperability. Thank you.